Okay, the next algorithm I'm going to go over is another L shape. The first thing you look for with this one is the 1 by 3 bar. So you either have one of these two cases. Then the next thing you look for is at the front here, there's a 1 by 2 bar, which is in line with the 1 by 2 bar at the bottom of the L. So like this case, it has the 1 by 3 bar, but this one only has the dot. How you hold this one is with, when performing the algorithm, is the 1 by 3 bar on the left and the L in the back right corner like this. Now this algorithm is easy to remember if you remember it in three sections. The first section, R prime F, R prime F prime. Then the next section, R2 U2. Then we go Y, then the sledgehammer, R prime F, R, F prime. So we'll go through it a, li a little bit quicker. R prime F, R prime F prime, R2, U2, Y, sledgehammer, R prime F, R, F prime. So to perform it a little bit quicker, what you need to do is after you do the first section, R prime, F, R prime, F prime, is while you're doing the R2, you turn it, do the Y as you're doing the U2, then you go into the sledgehammer, R prime, F, R, F prime. So the whole algorithm actually flows pretty nicely. So you go R prime, F, R prime, F prime, R2, while doing the U2, such so as R prime, F, R, F prime. So go through it twice more so you can follow along. R prime, F, R prime, F prime, R2, U2, while doing the Y, R prime, F, R, F prime. May as well do a few more examples. So we go R prime, F, R prime, F prime, R2, U2, while doing the Y, into the sledgehammer, R prime, F, R, F prime. R prime, F, R prime, F prime, R2, U2, while doing the Y, sledgehammer, R prime, F, R, F prime. So without mentioning, without going through talking about it, the whole algorithm should just flow like that.